Like, yeah, fraternity <laughs> initiation. <laughs> it's sort of like All a, right. a gentle gauntlet. So here's what we're doing. Now stand right here. Okay. Stand right here next to Senji. You don't have to stand in front of me, but just stand next to him. Yeah, that's and good. what I want to do is Sue is going to read a blessing for the world as I am going to bless you. But would you like to say what you want to say first or after? After. All right. I want to be inspired. <laughs> oh, okay. You're not inspired yet? Oh, no. No, I'm floating. Oh, okay. okay. Would you just hold that for me? Okay, I am going to silently bless you. And Sue's going to read. Sue, step forward just a little bit. This is a blessing for the world. Your gifts whatever you discover them to be, can be used to bless or curse the world. The mind's power, the strength of the hands, the reaches of the heart, the gift of speaking, listening, imagining, seeing, waiting. Any of these can serve to feed the hungry, to bind up wounds, welcome the stranger, praise what is sacred, and do the work of justice and offer love. Any of these can draw down the prison door, hoard bread, abandon the poor, obscure what is holy, and comply with injustice or withhold love. You must answer this question. What will you do with your gifts? Choose to bless the world. The choice to bless the world is more than an act of will, a moving forward into the world with the, excuse me, with the intention of doing good. It is an act of recognition, a confession of surprise and grateful acknowledgement that in the midst of a broken world, unspeakable beauty and grace and mystery abide. There is an embrace of kindness that encompasses all life, yours and ours. And while there is injustice, anesthetization, or evil, there moves a holy disturbance, a benevolent rage, a revolutionary love, protesting, urging, insisting, that which is sacred will not be defiled. Those who bless the world with their life as a gesture of thanks for this beauty and this rage. The choice to bless the world can take you into solitude to search for the sources of grace and power, native wisdom, healing, liberation. More, the choice will draw you into community, the endeavor shared, the heritage passed on the companionship of struggle, the importance of keeping faith, the life of ritual and praise, the comfort of human friendship, the company of earth, its chorus of life welcoming you. None of us alone can save the world. Together, well, that is another possibility, waiting, waiting. Mm. Amen. 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 May I, may I yes. suggest a blessing for Bix? Yes. Um, there's a song that in Plowshares and Jackie introduced me to about 25 years ago, a commissioning blessing that goes, May the blessing of God be upon you. May God's peace abide in you. May God's blessing I'm in it. Uh, well, thank you for being here. Uh, it's uh, this is such an incredible community, uh, and at times when I wanted to flee, you have pulled me at different times, different ones, back into community where there. That's where the strength is. 
mm-hmm. you know. So I am no more than who you are or what you are or who we are together. Uh, and uh, <coughs> I, I have to kind of blame you for. <laughs> <laughs> You know, for this, you know, for the hopes, I think, um, and that uh, I could not do any of this without any of you. But what I'm called to, you and probably even in greater ways are called to. Uh, the prayer of so many of you that touched on, we are called, all of us, we are called. And we are actually a very powerful, high, <laughs> we are actually a very powerful community. Mm-hmm. And I think it's really important if we don't know somebody here today to, to give your name to one another or that, exchange that. Uh, the strength is marvelous. The task is daunting. What's ahead of us, all of us, you know, uh, as John read so much in the commissioning there, uh, the forces around us are deadly. They're deadly for people that we know, deadly for people that we live among, you know. But the grace is abundant if we can walk in that. You know, and uh, to trust our hearts, you know, and especially in this, <coughs> I know, in this, uh, this community is uh, so life-giving, so strong, I think, uh, to what much is given, I think much is expected to, mm-hmm. you know, who we are mm-hmm. is powerful. Mm-hmm. And that's... Who was it? That was uh, Nelson Mandela says that's what you have. Kind of one of the things you have to fear is your own strength, mm-hmm. you know, in the sense of uh, walking, you know. And uh, as Jackie so often says, to, for us to take steps out of our comfort zone, mm-hmm. uh, you know, all of us. It's so easy to just sit down and light up a cigar or do something. <laughs> <good>. <laughs> you can afford them. But, uh, Steve Lantry does it. <laughs> uh, well, he but, can afford them. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> but I, I cannot tell you how grateful I am for you being here, and been, but for you who you are, and for the coming together, and just the strength that's there, the power, the grace, uh, the wisdom, you know, and uh, the courage. It's wonderful. Uh, it's so humbling to be a part of that. You know? And uh, so the graces that you prayed for today, I think they come to us as a community. You know, and uh, I very humbly walk at this particular time, but we're all called and uh, we all have strengths beyond imagining. You know, uh, and it comes from our community. Mm-hmm. I think that's it. Amen, brother. Amen. 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 Amen.